All right, so here we are. You can see I'm in Safari up here. I've got two tabs opened up on my computer. I've got Google and Google Images. And you can also see that I'm logged into my account. I'm in my school account. So if, you, if you're not there, go ahead and pause the video and get there now. So you've got to uh, be into Google and Google Images. Okay, so uh, back to my Google. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, click on the waffle and I'm going to go to slides. I could go to my drive and that's one way to do it. I could go to my drive up here and I could say, yeah, I want to do a new um, slide. I'm just okay, I got that. I could go that way. So that, that is one way. And you might always be going into your drive. So I don't mean to confuse you, but there are, there are like many roads that lead to making a Google um, Slides presentation. Or I could just go to my waffle and go to Slides right here. Or up here, I could go to slides.google.com. And lo and behold, it takes me to Google Slides as well. So, uh, so there's three ways, but let's just go back to beginning here and let's just go with kind of the normal waffle way of getting to what we want to do. So I'm just going to go to waffle and go to slides. That's the easiest way. Sorry if I've just confused you, but that's how I like to do it. All right, you can see that I've been working down here. This is my volcanoes report that I was working on as uh, I was preparing this lesson. So I've already kind of done a demo of it, but that was me. That was for me. So uh, since now you and I are together, let's go ahead and recreate it right from scratch. So um, You've got some templates up here of different uh, presentations, and we're not going to use any of those right now. I, I really encourage you to go take a look at them because they're really well made. Okay, and we're going to be using one in just a moment, but let's go ahead and go into it right now. Let's uh, click on blank, and it creates a nice blank presentation for us. And like I was talking about, we have these themes on the side. Now, this is a really important uh, thing I want you to remember trust the themes. I would say 95% of the time, they're really, really well done. The fonts, the colors, everything matches great, and you're not going to have to adjust anything. Now, we could, if we wanted to, we could just start with a basic, um, you know, the, the simple light one here, and then, you know, well, you know, and, and, and we could adjust everything from here. We could, you know, change the font to something different. We could change uh, the color of the font. Uh, you know, we, we could do a lot of different things, make it bigger, of course. Uh, even bigger than that. And you could totally design your own uh, slide after slide after slide, but that's that's a lot of work. So rather than that, let's go with one of these uh, pre-made templates that are going to help the, our look stay really nice and clean. And I've kind of gone through these and it's really important because you have to look and say, okay, what would make a good volcano one? Like, like this one, this kind of this high-tech one? Not really. This one here that looks like it's, you're going to some like party or something, you know, these are not really, but, but for a project that you're doing later on, it might be very applicable. So you kind of have to say what matches. And as I scrolled through all these, I came across this slate one here that I really liked. So this is the one we're going to go with here. So I'm just going to tap on slate. Um, I have to remove my uh, formatting from this right here. You can see I've already messed with it here and it's, it's kept that formatting. So so how I remove the formatting is I just, I'm going to click on these three little dots because it's not on my menu bar, but it's this, it's a T with a line through it. Text, basically, you're, you're erasing all the formatting that I've done to it. That's a really kind of important one for you to know, but it's clear formatting. And since it wasn't on my, my dock up here, I just had to click on the three dots and go find it. Okay, so if you messed with yours, go ahead and remove any formatting. And you can see already, this is a beautiful font with a beautiful background and everything's looking really good. So um, our first one is just, of course, just a title slide and you're gonna do the same thing. So, and remember, just go ahead and pause the video and you do this with me, okay? So um, so there's our title slide. So that's what we have. Volcanoes by, and then you put your name on it. Now to add a new slide, we're just gonna go up here to this, this plus button here. And you can see that we have the plus, we'll just go ahead and add a new slide. Okay, pretty common slide actually. Uh, and let me just go ahead and delete this. I'm going to delete it by just uh, pulling up the submenu, which is a two finger tap on your on your trackpad or right click on a mouse. And I'm just going to delete that slide. Okay, so, so the plus button just adds a normal generic type slide. Or you can just click on the little down arrow and you can have all the different slides you can use here. And I really want to go with um, some photos that have a caption under each one. So we're going to use this one a lot, this caption one. But if we had to give a lot of details, like say some bullet points, 
we could use um, the title and body one is, is one that's very common with students. But remember, we're going to go with minimal uh, text in this thing. So uh, I'm just going to go with caption here. And our first one, let me just go grab the paper here. Since we're doing uh, types of volcanoes, man, maybe I need one in front of that. But let's go with this uh, cinder cones. Cinder cones is our first type of volcano. And you can see I've typed it into there. That looks very nice. I can see right now I do want another title slide in here. So I'm going to create one here, a section header, and I'm going to call it uh, Types of Volcanoes. Okay, you go ahead and catch up to me here. So we have our title slide, and then we have kind of a header slide here, and then we have one called Cinder Cones. So if you're not there, go ahead and pause the video and get those three slides made. Okay, now before we go on, let's uh, title our presentation up here. So I'm just going to uh, click on that area there. It's called it Volcanoes. And I'm just going to put by Brad Quickinger. Uh, you're going to remember this, this title here is whatever your teacher has assigned you to title the project. Okay, so since we're just working together on this sample one, we're just going to call it Volcanoes. But put your name on it because you're going to turn this in later on to get graded for your badge. And it's helpful if the person doing the grading can see your name on each file so they uh, have a good idea who to give the badge to. All right, but that's going to complete it for this first little intro video. Uh, we covered a lot of things, how to create a new one, uh, how to add a couple slides. When we come back, we're going to get, get to work on just building out the, the draft of our presentation. So I'll see you in a few seconds.